A very warm welcome to the learning home. In this video, we are going to discuss uh, various features in the clipboard group in the uh, Microsoft Office 365 settings. So before I start, I'd like to bring to your notice that I'm using Microsoft Office 365. And if you are using different version of Microsoft Office, uh, you may see a little difference and but probably the core feature uh, should be remain same. So in this video, we are going to discuss uh, cut, copy, paste function in the format painter. So let's get started with the cut function. And in the cut function, what we generally do is we cut the text from one place and we move it to the other place and the content at the original place gets deleted. So imagine a situation where we want to move this whole sentence from here to somewhere else, then we will use cut function. So you will see at the point, this point, this cut and copy both are inactive. And when you select a sentence, which I have done it right now, and you will see the cut and copy both the functions are enabled. So I'm going to use either cut box or we can use the shortcut key that is called control x so i'm going to use this cut function here clicking it i will see this is already deleted from this place and i'm going to move it here which i can do it by clicking the paste or using the function shortcut called control v so i'm going to click it here and you will see it has moved over here so that is all about the cut function Second feature which I like to bring to your notice is the copy function and uh, it is used when we want to copy certain text from one place to another place. But in this feature the content at its original place uh, does not get deleted. So basically there is a kind of duplication of content. So imagine we want to copy this sentence from here and we want to paste it somewhere else. So Let's try this copy feature. The shortcut is Control C, and I'm going to use this uh, by clicking this copy, and I'm going to paste it here by either uh, uh, clicking the paste or Control V. So here you will see a difference that this text, this sentence, is here and here as well. So that is the primary difference between cut and copy. Now you will see a multiple uh, option in the paste function that is our third point of discussion and here you will see an option called keep source formatting, second one is the merge formatting, third one is the picture and keep text only. So we will try to show each and all and how does it look like. So imagine we are trying to copy this whole uh, paragraph and I have copied with the control C and I'm going to paste one by one. So I'm going to do the first thing. So here you will see I have copied all the four options and different way of uh, pasting. So first one is the, we call it keep source formatting and you will see this is the keep source formatting and the, it is exactly same as the original documents. There is no change at all. And second one is the merge formatting which is the second option, merge formatting, which you can see the second option. And this is the second option. And here you will see the uh, in this uh, option, basically what happens that uh, format of the uh, text got missed. But there are some of the uh, highlighting elements like bold, italic that remain same. And it retains the format of the uh, text in the paragraph where it is pasted. So actually this is pasted in this paragraph so it will take the format or uh, if there is existing uh, format standard it will mold itself in the new format. So that is all about the uh, merge formatting and third one is the it's called picture and you will see this is the picture format and you will see you cannot edit this document. You cannot edit this text from now onwards because this has become a picture format. And the last one is the text only. You will see the all the formatting style of the original document, or this one, got merged and become a text only. 
so that is all about the pasting option so i'm going to delete it to demonstrate the last uh, function that is the format painter so in this one what the format painter does is uh, it is uh, kind of painting the format like uh, what do we do we paint our walls with different colors if when we paint it with the white it become it appears white so similarly when we paint certain format it is painted in certain way so basically this is the this is uh, simply uh, we are painting a format on certain text that is all about so imagine this is a text and uh, it is of a uh, different uh, font group it is Arial black let's say and we want this text this one to be uh, copied this format to be copied on some more texts so what I'm going to do I'm going to select this whole sentence and I'm going to click this format painter and when you click it then you will see there is a brush icon appeared on the screen but this brush icon will disappear when I bring this in this area because this is the original format we have copied so it will appear only at the places where this format does not exist so you will see here when I bring it here you can see and by selecting this whole sentence or whole text it will change so we'll see this is the format of this one and this one remains same so I will go back to the original one by pressing ctrl Z so you will see by pressing ctrl Z undo it we have gone back to the previous uh, format so I'm going to show you another way like imagine we want we don't want to uh, change the format of all text but few text only few few words only so imagine I have I want to uh, copy the format of this one to only this and then some more but in this case what you have to do you have to again select it for select format painter and then you have to do it again and if you want to do further more text then you have to repeat the process which is basically a time consuming and often irritating so what we can do is we can click this we can select this text and uh, press uh, control shift c so basically with this function called control shift c we have copied the format and now we want to paste it just select this and enter uh, control shift v and we want to paste some more places select it and enter control shift v if you want something more please keep on doing so so this makes the whole process much simpler than the uh, copying once and doing repeating the process one by one is a time consuming process so uses of control shifts uses of uh, control shift plus c and control shift plus v makes our life uh, much easier that is all about the clipboard group how you have found the video please do write in the comment section and if you have liked it please do like and share for more videos please do subscribe and press the bell icon so that you will be notified about the coming videos with this i will say goodbye and see you soon